big up down the road. Mm -hmm. I know, so we can't go nowhere but down the road. <laughs> the heck so the year 2017 was an interesting year donald trump became the 45th president of the united states jamaica celebrated its 55th year of independence and down the road was born this year down the road turned Four years old, can you believe it? One, two, three, four. Beat my chest on cold. <laughs> Yo, it's been a crazy journey. I, I can't believe it sometimes. Like four years of food, four years of travel, four years of adventure, four years of culture. I don't think I ever sat down and actually told the story of Don't Know and how it came about and what it really means, you know? So I think we're going to do that today. So here it is, history class on a Sunday. Yeah, so the story of Down the Road is a cool one actually. Going back to 2016, not 2017. 2016, I got my first car and I said, yo, this is my time. I'm going to go gather up my friends. And every weekend, we went somewhere new. Whether it is some river over here, or a food festival over there, or some bar over here, a concert, you know, like we were all over and it was just so cool the fact that I had my car. and. I was able to do these things like anybody else you put your stuff on instagram and facebook and you're posting your stuff and one of my good friends actually used to see it and she's like yo you need to start a blog you need to do this thing and tell people about these places that you're going to and not just put it on the instagram page you know and you know kind of brush it off never really focus on that i just focused on the experience but after a while and after her in my ears all the time telling me to do this blog finally said all right I thought about it, then it just boiled down to me figuring out what I was going to name it. Sat down and I wrote a list and I slowly cut down that list. I sent it out to about 20 of my closest friends and I said, hey, yo, tell me which one of these you would use for a website. And luckily they actually chose the one that I liked the best, which was down the road, you know? And here we are. I started out as a blog where I would just write about these experiences. Every time I released a blog post, I'd put a video on it. That's it. That's really how Down the Road started and roots and it has grown from just a blog post where I used to write about my experiences to a whole lifestyle brand. I think it means a lot to a lot of people the fact that you're learning about different places in Jamaica and just the fact that you can find adventure just down the road so yeah in a nutshell that was the story of down the road but really and truly some stories start at the beginning but the down the road story really starts here it's been a long time since i've posted a video on this channel almost a year it was no fault of my own my laptop broke it just broke all of those months trying to get the parts trying to have it installed and back and forth with foreign and jamaica and i just gave up on that laptop there i was a couple months in unable to do anything unable to make any videos you know finally said to myself hey yo i think it's time i just try and invest in a new laptop we we're able to get it done and here we are we're back again what have i been up to all of these months where is everybody in the crew what have we been doing even though i wasn't editing and releasing any videos and even though we've had a lot of curfews and lockdown in jamaica i can't say that i've just been at home you know um i've done what i can within the time that i have so i've been on a couple trips to portland throughout this year a couple trips to nick grill doing some really fun and interesting things and going to some new places. Been in studio sessions with my brethren, 
learning about the whole creation process of music and vibing in the studio. We've been out to the beaches again, you know, linking up with my brethren Enrique and doing some paella stuff and gonna see more of that in the future. Now you might see this little hat as well. We launched the road clothes collection. So I had bucket hat, I had dad caps, I had t-shirt and thankfully to you, all of you people out there, all of my roadies, all of my friends and my family who supported this venture, everybody who purchased something from the road clothes collection. Thank you, I appreciate you forever. Thankfully, we got it done. It was a success and we're gonna do more merch in the coming months. So just look out for that. You can be a part of the movement and get your hands on some down the road merch. What's next for down the road? Well, obviously you see me here now. So videos are coming back. I have a lot of footage that I recorded throughout the year. So I'm going to be putting that stuff together. But the next video that you're going to see is Jerk Pan episode three, the finale, because we know that that ended abruptly and we're going to close that off, start some new things. We'll have some music projects working on. We're going to move to a more documentary type of vibe, a more educational, but fun. You know, like the vlog vibes was nice and thing and thing, but it's time to switch it up, time to do something new. 2021 when a pandemic corona is about people please do the right thing get the job if you don't want to get the job at least wear your mask and protect everybody else out there you know yeah so down the road is back more videos coming to you soon if you're still here watching thank you if you're subscribed thank you just all around if you support this brand if you follow down the road if you've liked a video if you've shared it with your friend if you've commented it's been four years of this it's been a passion project of mine and i want to sincerely thank all of you for being here i'm doing i am the founder chief content creator and operator of this brand down the road and if you're watching this you're a roadie thank you see you next time